matter to me than humanity. Hello and welcome to the Daughters of Sheba Foundation Human Interest Story, which is presented once weekly. Hi, my name is Claudia Testerine Campbell and I am the President and Chairperson of the Daughters of Sheba Foundation. I'm also a chaplain, a trained chaplain and a behavioral counselor. And so most of our content comes from that perspective, from my spiritual and my psychological or yeah endeavors in the field of psychology. So thank you for joining us and stay tuned as our video is coming up. Sit back and listen and learn. In the quiet corners of everyday life, extraordinary stories of resilience and transformation often unfold unnoticed. Did you know that self-love can significantly enhance happiness and mental well-being after 40? Embracing yourself at this stage can transform your entire outlook on life. Today, we're looking into the empowering journey of self-love after 40. It's a time when self-acceptance isn't just beneficial, it's essential. Join us as we explore the inspiring story of Maria Gonzalez, who discovered the profound impact of self-love in her 40s. Many women over 40 face a barrage of societal pressures, battling self-doubt and the relentless habit of comparing themselves to others. These challenges can make self-acceptance seem like an uphill battle. Meet Maria Gonzalez, a 45-year-old mother from San Antonio, Texas, whose profound journey from despair to empowerment inspires anyone battling their own storms. Maria's journey began in the shadow of tragedy, losing her husband unexpectedly and finding herself adrift. Five years ago, her world was shattered by the sudden loss of her husband in a tragic accident. Overnight, the homemaker and mother of two found herself facing an uncertain future, with no career prospects and the daunting task of raising her teenagers alone. Overwhelmed by grief and responsibility, her path to self-love was cluttered with obstacles. Through therapy, reconnecting with old passions, and cultivating new friendships, Maria slowly pieced together the fragmented parts of her self-esteem. The turning point came one quiet morning, as the sun cast gentle rays over Maria's garden, a place she had turned into her sanctuary. While meditating amidst the blooms and fresh air, a profound realization washed over her. Maria understood that her self-worth was not tied to her age, the roles she played, or the tragedies she had endured. It was rooted in how she valued and cared for herself. This moment of clarity was powerful, and it sparked a transformative idea. Driven by her newfound perspective, Maria decided to channel her experiences into something that could benefit others facing similar challenges. She founded Uplift Her Foundation, a charity dedicated to supporting widows and single mothers who struggle with grief and financial hardships. Uplift Her Foundation provided workshops on financial literacy, mental health support, and career counseling, all designed to empower women to rebuild their lives with dignity and independence. Maria's journey of self-reflection didn't just change her, it ignited a beacon of hope and practical aid for countless others. Her garden, once a place of solace in her darkest times, became the metaphorical ground for sowing seeds of change and growth in her community. Every plant she nurtured, every blossom that unfurled, mirrored the triumphs of the women she now helped to empower. Maria's story is a testament to the fact that from personal healing can come profound societal impact. Maria's story is a powerful testament that it's never too late to rediscover your self-worth and start anew. Her journey of self-love catalyzed a movement, proving that personal healing can indeed lead to collective empowerment. Do you have a story of self-discovery and love after 40? Share it in the comments below. We'd love to hear how you've navigated your journey. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and click the bell for more stories like Maria's that inspire and celebrate life at any age. Thanks for watching. We would love to hear your feedback on the topic discussed in this video. Share your thoughts in the comments. See you next time.